Um, today I'm going to be showing you guys how to clean uh, rastaclats or any type of laced um, bracelets, just basic bracelets, not those leather kind or anything like that. So I'll be showing you and then stay tuned because I have a little surprise or just something I'd like to say. Okay, so two things you're going to need is two Tupperwares. Uh, you're going to want to put soap in one and water in the other. Um, you're not going to just spray the soap on. You're not going to just throw it in there and you're not going to be, you're going to be gentle to it and you're going to. Just take your time and do all that goody-goody stuff. So get a soap and put it in, and then you're also going to use a toothbrush to brush all, all that stuff out. You're also going to want to make sure that the soap isn't going to affect the little color of the bracelet or anything like that, and pick whatever flight scent you want. You're also going to want to use some cologne as well, uh, any type of perfume you like. Just spray it at the end when everything's all dry and ready. Um, these bracelets I have are really durable, but the rest of clots aren't that good, so you're going to want to be delicate. You're going to need an iron as well to spray the steam on and to kill all the bacteria and all the nasty smells. You're also going to need a blow dryer to blow a dry when your bracelets are wet and all that stuff. So, um, I'm going to be using a white bracelet today, uh, just to show you guys a demonstration on how to do, do it. first is you just want to get some water and just get it a little moist now what you want to do is you don't want to run it um as you could see if you can see don't run it ag up against the braid run it down because you don't want the strings to unravel and get nasty so you're going to want it want to run um against the braid like this and just get it all nice and kind of wet ish so now that it's all good and all damp you're going to want to get some Topay, not a lot. Please don't put a lot. You're gonna need just this much. I don't even know if you can see that, but it's just like a simple dab like that, and just use a dab of it. So what you're gonna do is just put it on. If you guys put too much soap on it. Um, like I almost kind of did. You could just go ahead and stick it in the water. It might bubble up, but like that's not even a problem. So just chillax. But um, just rinse it off. Don't don't do it for too long. And if if you do mind this getting wet, then just go like in, but don't put it in all the way. Go like this. Don't leave it in there for like a minute, like some people. What I'm going to be doing is iron, not ironing it, not putting it on. Like I said, do not put this on. Just no. That's what you're not gonna do. What you're gonna do is you're gonna use the steam. If you have it, um, you use it to just get your clothes wet, but what this is doing, it's killing all the nasty bacteria and germs that your bracelet has from wearing it so, so many times. So, okay, we're going to take a quick intermission here. I forgot to tell you how long to uh, steam it for, so only steam it to, for about 15 to 20 seconds, and that's about it. Okay, after you're done drying it for 15 to 30 seconds, you're going to want to blow dry it. You can blow dry it for about, like, um, 15 to 40 uh, five seconds until you're satisfied of how dry it is you're gonna want to make sure that all the moisture is out so you don't get a like nasty mildew smell after so just keep on drying it till it's completely dry and that's about it it's all dry well kind of so it's all kind of dry and it's perfect i mean it's pretty decent guys to be honest for like minute or two worth of cleaning maybe more five minutes let's be honest so i mean oops i threw it over there so let's be honest like it's kind of cool to where i hate my life i spilt water okay so these are kind of more durable they're army bracelets um you're gonna want to do the same exact process as the other one with a steam to blow dryer unless you honestly don't care about these that much like i do care but um, you're going to want to just throw them in the water. Like, they're durable, so it doesn't matter. You can throw soap on it, but you are going to want to steam them, get rid of all the germs, and blow dry it, and spray it with cologne and all that good stuff. So, yeah, same process as the other one, but these are more durable, so don't worry. Like okay, so it's two months later, and I just put that video in the back of my head. So, I'm barely trying to finish this up now. But if you guys like, comment, and subscribe on this video, I will be giving a free rest of cloud away. And so I will enter you in the competition. You just have to live in the U.S. Like, comment, and subscribe this video. And I'll enter you in this raffle. But you guys have to answer before, um, let's say, 
the last day of this month, which is going to be July 30th or 31st. I don't know. I don't know my months or whatever. <laughs> but yeah, so it's going to be this month. Last day of this month is going to be the last day to enter. I'll put each one of you. I'll give each one of you a number and then just like have a number generator and then pick one of you. And then um, I'll probably tell you in my next video or something that you won and then like you can email me or you can text me or you can kick me or whatever social you have and I'll mail it to you. But you can just tell me whatever Rastaclat you like, any of these ones that you like, um, or just send me a picture of a rela a rel oh, sorry, a Rastaclat you like or maybe even an army bracelet and I'll buy it for you and I'll send it to you. So that's all you guys gotta do. Just like, comment, and subscribe. So thank you. Bye. It's not stopping.